If you cannot sleep at night because of your trading positions, but you would like to sleep like a baby through these moves, knowing you have the technical analysis on point, then the champions level is for you. And that is what we are going to be going through today, ladies and gentlemen. We're going to be going through the gold mine that is technical analysis. How we are trading Bitcoin right now, I'm going to be going over the position that I hold right now on my main account. We're also going to be going over how we got to this level and why having a trading plan is oh so important. Stick to the plan, make money. That's what we're going to be going over here. Let's begin. So, as you know, very publicly, I made you all aware of that I thought we were in a wave four, but this was wave four before we have our fifth wave to the upside. Should we go over the, some of the technical analysis? Before we go over what's happening right now, let's get ourselves up to speed of how we got to that level. So if you look here, we had this lovely wave four correction, which in my opinion, literally is a lovely wave four. If I show you, I will share with you some of the technical analysis of why I had no fear in this move down yesterday. We'll put on the channel really simply we'll put on the channel look at this ladies and gentlemen how it times it to the exact low we'll also add on the cc from the last low to the high look at this right into the cc and one more thing we will go from the high to the low to the high and there we go the one-to-one -one into the cc into the bottom of the channel what do we have in here ladies and gentlemen what we have is quite perfectly an a d C correction in a wave four. That is exactly what I was trading for. Wave four before we come up for the fifth wave. We've now got that move to the upside. Um, but what I want to show you here is this was obviously the come down yesterday for the wave four. Now I want to take you back a step. And while we were in this section, the trading plan that I was giving to everybody. So I was looking for a, a potentially a swing failure pattern of the high. And as we can see, we clearly got, okay, if we just look at this, we got no swing failure pattern of the high. There was no swing failure pattern. So then you come on to 11,700, or for me, it was 11,700, where I was looking to ladder my shorts up to this level. So my plan is really clear. I'm looking for this to finish its way four in a few days before we get our rise up to $11,700, where we had confluence. I'll cover some of those confluences for you. But that was really my trading plan. Uh, as I was saying, that that 11,700 is, is a really important resistance. And... Um, should I get stopped out and invalidated on this trade? That's absolutely fine. I'm happy to take a loss on this one because if you're not happy to take a loss, then you're not happy to make money because every trade has a risk. But I was feeling very confident in this short position. I I had the I had the feeling that it would go right. Um, as I was saying down here, I have a good feeling about this short. I just had a really good feeling. And well, we can see from now it, it's absolutely worked. I, I don't think anyone's surprised by now. <laughs> <laughs> but it obviously worked really well. I want to take you back a step once more. So when we were coming down yesterday, so there was, I mean, I've just shown you the, the, the level we bounced off here. You cannot get more technical. You cannot get more perfect when it comes to technical analysis. Classic ABC correction onto the bottom of the channel, into the one-to-one, -one, into the CC. I mean, absolute gold mine here. Absolute gold mine. Uh, I'm trying. I, I'm, I'm trying my best in this video not to brag. I, I don't want to brag and let my ego get the best of me because I really could go off on one because it has been really nice. I'm going to try and not do that. So we can see. I'll let my trading do the talking. I'll, I'll let my trading do the talking. Uh, so we obviously bounced off the bottom of the channel. And that is where, well, before we bounced off, while we were down here at the lows. OK, so while we were down at the lows, uh, you can see I was making the post yesterday at uh this is the one i'm referring to here uh yesterday at 1353 so this is while we were on this candle and have a guess what's happening loads of people have switched bearish at the lows we've just had a perfect technical bounce but what's happening people are switching really really bearish they're going into their shorts aggressively and this is where you need a voice of reason this is where you need somebody that understands how the market works I'm really clearly saying to my team, my idea of the 11,700 push or alternatively the swing failure pattern has not changed. I still believe that we can push upwards. So this is where having the voice of reason of the day, can you imagine if I come into the group like, oh my God, we've just broke down, everybody's short. You know, that's obviously an emotional trader that doesn't know what he's doing. I'm coming in here with a clear voice of reason, clear perspective, 
showing the levels that we've bounced off of and still expecting higher, still ultimately sticking to my plan. And obviously what we can see is the levels then that we came up to so really well <laughs> that that was a good idea we'll come back up to the four hour chart and we'll go over the level then we rejected off of so why was i looking why was i so aware of the eleven thousand seven hundred? i'm going to delete those things that we added on here so i'm going to delete that delete that delete that and delete that um mike actually done a really nice public live stream yesterday didn't he his first one for the public um he was showing you this parallel channel so obviously we had the parallel channel uh that was looking at this as you can see here 11,700 was the level i was looking at but um we obviously come up to the top of the parallel channel and shout out to mike who was doing a live stream last night at 1 a.m he done a 1 a.m live stream for the champions uh, <laughs> dedication but um so yeah we obviously had the parallel channel up coming up here at around 11,660 dollars so you had the parallel channel of the major uptrend and again this is still in an uptrend but what I really liked about this is we had the NPOC at exactly 11,700. So that's another level of confluence. And you also obviously have your monthly. So you can see that you have the monthly here, the weekly 11,925. But the also you had that monthly going on. So for me, there was four major confluences that why we were going to reject 11,700. And this is why I'm happy to put my money where my mouth is. I'm happy to take the trades. And if I take a loss, I take a loss. But what have I done? I've taken another win. And I guess it's not just me that's taken a win on this. Because I woke up this morning very happy. And um, because I, I slept for a baby for it. My, my plan was simple. I had my laddered short positions. And I, so I was able to sleep like an absolute baby last night. <laughs> it was brilliant. Um, but yeah, I woke up to this. I saw loads of people in the group got that short. It was absolutely great. That makes me very happy. And uh, yeah, that laddered short entry to 11,700 working out very well indeed. And uh, yeah, this is brilliant. You can see that lots of people in the group shorting around the same level. This is this is AJ Crypto's first buy bit. We had a lot of people actually recently and they've been taking their first trades and they've been doing well. But you can see everybody basically closing out around those highs. 11,660, 11,630, 11,640. Uh, you got some Ethereum trades in here. Um, this is this is another guy's first three trades in the group. First three wins. Uh, there's, there's Magic Mike <laughs> with the short from 11,670. There is moi. The short from 11,693. And the other legend that is Igor with Priceless Trace, 11,690. Um, so, yeah, you can see that we, we've been doing well. We have been doing well. And these were the people up at 1.30 to trade that. I was asleep, but yeah. <laughs> uh, just goes to show that technical analysis works. Champion members absolutely raking it. Because how can you not? That's technical analysis, what we like to call perfection. So no swing failure pattern of the high. You make your way up to 11,700. You reject off of the key 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 11,700 and now you bring yourself to where you are now um so things to bear in mind okay and well clearly we're still in an uptrend aren't we so I've got although I've got a short position from basically the very high here $30 from the high uh I absolutely acknowledge that this can still go higher because what are we doing here we are locally at the very least building our higher highs higher lows higher highs higher lows higher highs higher lows higher highs higher lows higher highs this could be the higher low for the higher high Okay, so you've got to bear that in mind, ladies and gentlemen. There's absolutely no guarantees that this is the high. There's no guarantee that this is the high, and it absolutely can push higher. This is why I am a keen advocate of taking profits. Um, you know, they're absolutely key. It is absolutely key to take profits um, because at the end of the day, you've still got bullish market structure. So you can start to get some signs of confirmation. Uh, I will show you this, by the way. I, I didn't th don't think I showed you this, but... If you like the templates and things that I share, that this was the template that I've given to the chat contenders and champions. And look at this, this absolute bang into that MPOC um, before you got obviously that great rejection. Um, but yeah, moving back over to, to this, uh, what you can see here is, uh, so we got no massive divergences and you're back up. Okay, so you, you basically, in, so you're in once again a mini range and this is why we like to trade mini ranges. So you've got another mini range. You've obviously got a bit of resistance trying to act as support. So the trend is definitely still up. The trend is definitely still up. <laughs> would I like that to be the higher? Yeah, probably I would. But nevertheless, the trend is still up. So what am I going to do? I'm going to pay myself on the short position. I'm going to take profits. 
and I'm going to continue to monitor. Well, really simply, you can just monitor the market structure. Like that is that is really easy. You can just monitor the market structure. Obviously, you've got different time frames to monitor this on, but at the end of the day, you, you got to monitor the, the market structure that's going on here. Um, key levels I can give you, obviously, that, or that, that, that monthly, uh, really key, which is actually a weekly. Um, and that NPOC, so 11,700, right? So it's like I originally said at the time, like, that for me is the most important. It, is, it was just a really important resistance. And uh, to see the high, higher wick onto that level, I just, I, I must admit, it feels good. Um, and so, yeah, I took a leverage short for this, but I was laddered into it. And uh, from here, taken profit, simply because we are going resistance back into support, potentially. So this is a good place to pay yourself. And that way, if the trend does continue upwards, well, at the end of the day, you'll have still made money. And depending, obviously, on the percentage of your profit and your stop loss, which could be potentially in, in profits right now. Um, and then you've got the levels to be aware of if we push to the upside monthly, weekly. When if you get above that, it's, I've said it before, if we get above this, it's extremely bullish, in my opinion. Very, very bullish indeed. And if you start to break down, you start to break market structure and you start to break crucial supports, which you have around 11,300. And then obviously you have 11,150. Then you have... 10,915 so those are three important levels to the down and really two to the upside um today we've got a mini range going on and this is the thing that i'm going to highlight here we are not ultra bullish well i am never ultra bullish and i'm never ultra bearish i will trade the charts i do my technical analysis i trade the charts i make money i do not make money by having a bias anybody that trades with a bias anybody that wakes up this morning thinking oh my god look how bullish this is i'm just gonna long or oh my god i'm so bearish i'm just gonna you, know, you just got to trade the charts trade what's coming to you you know make a plan i think that's the key thing make a plan and that's how i can sleep with you know that's how i can sleep at night because i know i have a plan i know before i enter the trade how much i'm willing to lose so it's all about risk management you know like i was saying i'm, I'm absolutely fine if i take a loss on this because i know the risk that i'm taking um but once again <laughs> managed to absolutely nail the high um and i'm waking up to 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 profits really nice profits at that um so that's obviously good we are bouncing off of support this is a take profit the trend is up it absolutely can continue higher there's no doubt about that if it does i've given you some of the key levels to be aware of and if we do break down, I've given you some of the key supports. But this for me is a take profit, okay? Got to be taking profits because the trend is still up. Uh, I guess I'll end with this as well, by the way. This was this was pretty funny. Uh, so yesterday uh, at 11 o'clock at night, we had Crypto Cowboy <laughs> posting in the spectators chat by accident saying that we're at a really important level. And uh, yeah, shout out to the people that were closing down at those lows. That was a really, really good trade. But um, yeah, this was obviously posted in the Spectators chat. So if you like these little bit of gold that occasionally get dropped here, either by customer service, he'll try and sometimes drop a little bit of golden nuggets in here, uh, or just people accidentally posting. And this is obviously the free, absolutely free uh, Discord chat that we have where people can share ideas. So if you want to join the free Spectators Discord, I will leave the link in the comments below. And, you know, that's absolutely... Um, Feel free to come along and join a join a community of top traders. Obviously, if you want the trading plans that I'm giving, uh, this is for the champions level, uh, where you get access to my ideas, you get access to uh, people's questions and answers, and also I'm starting the live trading series where i will be going live trading on live stream where i'll be going through my entries, exits, you know, stop losses, take profits, how to compound, how to ladder. Uh, everything that a professional trader does on live stream so i feel that this is absolutely brilliant if you want a space where you can learn make money have friends have a trading family have a community people that push you on people that's full of positivity then the champions group is well we got a lot of people in that show. It was great. It was brilliant. And we're all waking up very happy today to take profits. And so if you're if you're after that sort of community uh, as well as obviously the education it's not only the trading updates the plans but also the education how i get to these levels how i'm working this out how we're doing these these areas of confluence and that's what we teach as well um so if you're after that we got that live trading trading series starting um so we're more than happy to have you along i uh, hope that you have a brilliant week and i'll catch you in the next update thank you everybody and goodbye cheers